Go, baby, go. Okay. Hi, guys. It's Nina. Welcome back again. Uh, I'm doing this in sun because I want to paint. And I'm excited about something. Oh, you know what? I'm doing flip cups. Mm -hmm. I don't even need uh -uh. that. <laughs> Darn it. First color is Artist Loft Black Flow Acrylic mixed with Liquitex Gloss Medium and Varnish and Floetrol. This one is a little thinner than all my other paints leaving a very, very small mound before it sinks in. I have two cups of that. I also have Golden's Permanent Deep Violet, which is mixed with gloss medium and varnish and Floetrol. It is leaving a very tiny mound. I have Copper from Golden's, the Copper Iridescent Fine, which is leaving a very tiny mound. My favorite 24 karat gold. I'm excited about this one, I'm like breathing heavy. <laughs> Okay, pink tourmaline, beautiful color. Anthraquinone blue from Golden's. Tiny mound on a mound on a mound. And that's my second cup of black. So, uh, I wanna do a flip cup, three flip cups actually, with black and all these other colors. So, I'm just gonna go for it because I've seen people do it and it always looks crazy to me, but it works. So, so I'm gonna put black in the bottom. I don't have any silicone in my paint either, so, but we're still going to get cells. I know we are, because I always get cells. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put some copper in next. I'm just going to pour it in. Dirty cup. Okay. I think for, for beginners, this is one of the most satisfying pours you can do, especially because you don't have to really worry about how much and you know, pretty much all you need to really care about is to make sure your consistency is a little bit thinner in the base coat one, and then other than that, make sure the rest of them are the same consistency. There's the pink tourmaline. Now we're going to put some anthraquinone blue in there. It amazes me that these colors actually stay separated. I'm going to put a little bit more violet. Like it's already selling up inside the cup. <laughs> uh, I want to put a little bit more pink. And some gold. I kind of want to pour it from up high so it sinks down in there. Like this one, I didn't pour it from high enough and it's sitting there. So there we go. Now it went down. A little bit more copper. Violet. Resisting the urge to put more black in there. Put in this one because it's too low. Alright. Okay. This is gorgeous cells on here already. Okay. Let's do this. Let me move these out of the way. I'm excited about this. <laughs> I did a sandwich pour last week and it was so much fun flipping the cups over. It was like, I was giggling like a little kid. It was awesome. So, okay, here we go. Move these out of the way first so we don't have any accidents. Probably should have done more than three, but that's okay. Okay, I'm not going to put it right up at the edge right there. I'm going to put it more like over here. Okay. One. Two and three. Huh. It didn't even splash this time. Darn it. That was the fun part. <laughs> it might just get a big mess. Okay. There's some beautiful little teeny tiny cells popping up already. And right there also. Yay! Okay. So we're going to maybe start over here and just kind of lift and come back at the same time. Okay, that's one. 
Look at all those cells already starting. Woohoo! Maybe we'll bring this one down here and we'll go that way. And... That's so pretty, a lot of violet in that one. And then our third one. Cool. This is so pretty. It's like these that copper and the violet together is just kind of psychedelic and very cool looking. Kind of hippie-ish. Now I do have black and I do have some more of my other colors. I think we have enough paint on here though that we don't really need to worry about it much, but I am gonna put some black in there. All right. Resisting the urge to mess with it too much. So we already have some pretty cells starting. Let's go ahead and tilt this. I'm gonna walk it down the canvas. This is beautiful over here in this corner. Gorgeous. That copper is amazing. Alright, so where are we? down so it gets to right here and then I'll just return it off.
can take off that bubbly bubbly part right there because there's still a lot of paint on here but some of it can come off easy stretch those ones up there on top out just a bit. So you still very good. I think I might take off some more down there. Take off some of the very biggy stuff and give the other things a chance to really show off and look pretty. <laughs> There's some beautiful cells in here though. I might search it again in a second. I love it though. Really cool. Are you popping bubbles, honey? She is. There's some very cute little cells in here. Coming up in like this green gold and this blue. And then the copper is back there. Very neat. This copper corner is just amazing. And there's stuff underneath there that's going to come up too. I can see it. And over here with the violet and then the anthroquinone blue. And just a little bit of lacing of that violet on top. It's very pretty with some black. And there's that corner we put on. Which I'm glad I did. Because they're pretty. That one's pretty too. I like that violet with the copper. I really like it. That's such a cool... And then over here where we get into the blue where it mixed with the gold, that gave us a turquoise color. Pretty neat. It's like a peacock feather. Okay. <laughs> but I like where the black mixed with the gold also here. It gave us that darker hued gold tone. Which I have a lot of those cells coming up here. Very neat. Let's torch it again. <laughs> I think that's it. Okay, so 
that was cool. I like that. I think it's really pretty. <laughs> I bet it's really kind of blingy in the sunlight. Let's see. Nope, it's blingy. <laughs> I think that's neat. I'm going to leave that there and I'm going to take the camera and take some close ups for you guys. I will see you in a minute. Okay, so I just took the camera down. <laughs> this turned out so cool. <laughs> I love flip cups. They're just so much fun. And it's such a beautiful result, you know, the just the way that the colors blend just enough, but they're still, you can see each and every one of them. We have our copper, we have our gold, we have our violet, we have our blue. You know, just really, really pretty. On top of a sort of blackish background. So over here, you see that copper, you see the blue, you see those gorgeous violet cells. You see that bling. And this part, I love these. Where is it? There's some little tiny cells in here that are just amazing. The most beautiful little things. <laughs> yes, I know, I'm in love with cells, it's crazy. That's so pretty right there. I love that curve. It's very fluid and organic and a lot of movement and flow. Very pretty. Oops. A little too close. Sorry about that. Okay. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. I will show you when it's dry. Okay. So, this is my little flip cup adventure going rogue. <laughs> it does have a very galactic feel with it, so I'm calling this one Rogue One. <laughs> it's really fun to do. I love this. And these colors in here are just... Oh my gosh, that pink tourmaline mixing with the copper and the violet is just insanely beautiful to me. I love that. And you see the anthraquinone blue in there. And then you see that gold, 24 karat gold blinging, where it mixed a little bit with the copper right there. Really cool. And over here, this section with that copper corner is just amazing. I love copper copper obsession <laughs> and these beautiful cells down here with the 24 karat gold floating very pretty I love that violet so this is the anthraquinone blue and the permanent deep violet and the 24 karat gold and the copper and the pink tourmaline this is rogue one I hope you guys enjoyed this one hey if you can please check and see if you're subscribed and uh, you hit the notification bell because I would really appreciate it if you would do that for me um, let you know when we've uploaded new videos <laughs> uh, thank you so much for watching I really do appreciate it this one was a lot of fun I enjoy going rogue every once in a while <laughs> I'm very excited about the new Star Wars movie coming out so all Star Wars all the time baby anyways thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys for the next one have a great day